Hello, and welcome to the growing collection of videos made and produced by yours truly, me. This video presentation is all about Albania. I'll be taking a look into Albanian culture and cultural identity, how Albania protects its cultural identity, and why it tries to protect it. First off, let's take a look at Albania's cultural identity. Let's start by taking a look at Albania's flag. The flag consists of a black, two-headed eagle on top of a red background. The color red has great significance in Albania's culture. It represents bravery, strength, valor, and bloodshed. The eagle stands for the sovereign state of Albania. Albania's official language is Albanian. Its population is 2.86 million. Its GDP is 15.3 billion USD. It covers an area of 11,100 square miles and its national sport is soccer. Albanian attire consists of more than 200 different forms of clothing, usually very colorful and abundant in detail. These outfits are often decorated with various designs like pagan symbols, suns, eagles, moons, stars, and snakes. The majority of Albanians are Islam and Christian, but there are many non-religious people as well. If you get a haircut in Albania, the hairstylist will slap you on the back of the neck and say, Mi shenda, which means on your health, or good luck. An even more interesting thing about Albanian culture is that when people say yes, they shake their head. Respectively, when they say no, they nod their heads. Next, I'll cover how Albania protects its cultural identity. Unlike other countries that enforce strict laws or create impassable borders, Albania protects its cultural heritage by establishing cultural institutions protected by the government to preserve Albanian culture. Many of those institutions are situated in the capital, Tirana. And to give some context about what I mean by institutions, I'll name a few. The National Library, the National Theater, the Opera and Ballet Theater, the National Museum of History, and the National Museum of Fine Arts. Finally, I'll go over why Albania tries to protect its cultural identity. Albanian culture is unique to the rest of the world. Albania has resisted and survived some of Europe's strongest empires, including Alexander the Great, the Roman Empire, the Byzantine Empire, the Kingdom of Bulgaria, the Servian Kingdom, the Venetian Republic, and the Ottoman Turks. It survived all of this without losing its language or culture. Albania is one of the most isolated countries in all of Europe. Albania has many magnificent places to visit. Its terrain ranges from the North Alps to the Adriatic and Ionian Sea. Albania's cultural heritage is quite diverse as well, including ancient cities, museums, natural parks, ancient churches, ancient Greek amphitheaters, and more. Albania's tradition has truly survived the test of time. Some women in the north of Albania still wear the same dresses they wore a hundred years ago. While the majority of Albanians use the internet and mobile phones, some still live exactly as they did a hundred years ago, without modern inventions. Since it's so isolated, Albania is pure. It hasn't been disturbed by mass tourism because no one knows it exists. Few people know very much about Albania, making it easy for the small country to stay divine in its own right. Albania has many magnificent.